This week, we have an amazing opportunity. We have an opportunity to perform for the one and only Kitty Garcia. <laughs> YCDT is not new to artists or performing for concerts and tours and overseas. This is what we do. I train my dancers really, really hard so that once they leave, they can go off and do great things. I've had dancers dance for Peter Pan. I've had dancers dance on Broadway. And I even have dancers dance for Janet Jackson. So for me, you know, this is just another opportunity for my dancers to be exposed on the next level. When you do lyrical movement, it has to kind of be continuous, right? So the thing is, you know, I have quite a few repertory dancers, and I'm looking for a dancer that's going to be able to grab my attention, who know how to emote, someone who's not afraid to just let go and fully and truly express themselves unapologetically. And come on, more Janae, you're not doing that with your face. Come on, more, more, more Janae, you look dry. Let me ask you a question: How do you real? You're 13. How do you? 17. You're 17, so you have four more years on this earth than this little girl. Why does she have more emotion than you? So sometimes in rehearsals, if I feel like one dancer is like really, really excelling over another dancer, I'll put them side by side. And what that does is I'm letting you know who's your direct competition. And right now, I feel like Janae is like sinking. You know what I mean? I think the pressure of me calling her out on the spot to have her compete against somebody who's noticeably younger than her, that has to be a shot of her ego. Y'all know how I feel about pretty dancers, right? Like, I'm not telling you that your face can't be beautiful. Pretty dancers to me are very prissy and they're reserved and they hold back because they feel like their face is enough to get them, like, get them the gig. I don't care about that. Right now, I'm really, really getting on Janae because she's not really emoting and she's not giving me any type of passion. I think Janae is kind of stuck in a space in her life where she's really concerned about what people think of her. So I think that's the reason why she's not giving me what I need. You're about to graduate school in a year. And then you're going to be out there in the real world competing against these little girls that's been dancing all their life. They came out the womb dancing. You understand what I'm saying? If y'all was to go right now for the, for the same job, she'll get the job. I think for Janae to get to the next level that I need her to be at, she's just going to have to learn how to just ignore people and just be completely confident and comfortable in her own skin. Until that happens, she's never going to be able to do it. And the next time I see you, we're going to audition. <laughs>